Hey everyone, Shadow here, and welcome to another Marvel Contest of Champions video. So it's season 30, and this is war number nine. We're getting there, we're getting there. And looks like we're going up against an alliance called the Demon's Legend. All right, so let's go ahead and spectate, see what they have in store for us. Uh, as you can see, this time I'm nice and early. Uh, first one in, uh, I take path three in sections one and two. So this first path, uh, there is no uh, defender on that first node, which is common. Uh, the second one, I'm fighting an Ultron. So I see that Ultron and I know that I can get two missions from Corvus, uh, for Corvus, because this Ultron has an evade phase. So if I play it carefully and I attack him when uh, he's in that evade phase, he will evade. And that way I can knock him down and I'll have the tech and the evade. Uh, then we've got this uh, Medusa who used to be really nasty. And she's still annoying, but uh, we usually don't have any problem with her. Now, uh, if I bring in Corvus, what I could do, I can bring in Proxima. And then I won't have any problems uh, whatsoever uh, with her. Then we've got in the middle here another possible um, mission. Yeah, this, this doesn't look like it's too bad. So I can take Professor X. Um, I won't have enough uh, energy to get all the way there in this first go. But that would be three missions. Okay, and then we've got Dr. Doom. And uh, let me see. Corvus could do that. Corvus can do that fight. Then we've got um, Colossus here. That's Claire all day, every day. We've got Hulkbuster. Again, Corvus. We've got Guardian. Corvus can do that fight. Uh, Warlock can do that fight. All right. And then here we've got uh, Sentinel on Rage. Annoying, but Corvus could do it if I'm careful uh, and just play him stun immune style once he gets the Rage. Uh, Overseer, Corvus can do that as well. Uh, that Penny Parker, I will avoid. I hate fighting her. Corvus can do it, but I hate fighting her. Um, down here, we've got Guillotine 2099. We've got Bishop, and we've got Null. Uh, Null shouldn't be too much of a problem, but that Bishop is real annoying. Uh, so hopefully the backup will bring in uh, counters for uh, those there. So might be switching up a little bit, bring in a Corvus, Bring in a Proxima so I don't have to worry about, um, well, auto block. Yeah, that could help me with uh, Guardian as well, uh, having that true strike up. Might even help with uh, Penny if I end up being needed to, you know, help out with her, finish her off. So yeah, Corvus, Proxima, and then uh, Claire. So Corvus can take Ultron and Medusa, possibly that Doom. He can take that um, Professor X. Claire can take that Corvus. I mean, take that uh, Colossus. And Corvus can take that Hulkbuster and uh, possibly that Guardian as well. All right. I think that's what I'll do. All right. So we'll be right back with the fighting. All right. We're back. And as you can see, I'm going in with a team that I don't usually go in with. All right. I've got Black Widow, Deadly Origins. I usually go in with her. But I'm also going in with Corvus and Proxima. The reason why is because there were so many champions that I saw that I could fight that Corvus was going to just destroy. 
So I knew I didn't need Warlock, for example. All right, so first fight is Ultron. He's a tech. Also, he evades. So if I can get him to evade and knock him down with a special or a heavy, then I can get that mission as well. So I can get two missions off of Ultron. All right, so starting off, I'm trying to wait for his evade phase. That's why you see me doing this here. I'm watching for it. Okay, now I'm trying to do it. There we go. Got him to evade. Now I just need to knock him down. Boom, boom, boom. He's down. Now I've got that mission, which is going to make me hit harder even in this fight because you get that mission in the fight. So now I'm hitting harder. And uh, when I finish this fight, I'm going to have a second mission because he's tech. Don't look at that. It happens in war. Somehow, I'll be sitting here just staring at my thumb as I'm just blocking. And I'm like, okay, I'm holding block. I haven't moved my finger, and I'm getting hit. How'd that happen? But whatever. All right, so down goes Ultron. Now, this fight here, Medusa used to be the GOAT defense you would see her all the time as the boss and she was nasty and i used to take her out with corvus boosted to the hilt that's how we took out the bosses and sometimes if she was really really um aggressive we didn't manage to do it all right see so look at this auto block don't care that's why i brought proxima okay i saw all of that and that's why I laid out my strategy, because I knew I was going to get that evade so that I was going to have true strike and she was just going to go down real easy. All right. So um, here we go with this Professor X and he's a mutant. So I'm looking at this and I'm like, OK, this doesn't look that bad. You know, we've got the backup recovery as long as I play it safe and just kind of, you know, take it easy, we should be able to handle this fight. I don't usually take this fight, but feeling myself and I got Corvus and he's got charges. So I'm thinking, yeah, we can do this. But I want to make sure I'm not taking any chances and I wanted to um, be at full health when I was going into this fight. All right, so here we go. And the main thing that I have to worry about with fighting him, I'm trying to keep track of that falter timer. That's what will really mess me up a lot. You know, see, here we go. I backed off, falter is ready. So I need to swipe, get that falter off of me. There we go. Now we can go in. That's really it to fighting him. All right, you see, I'm just blocking because I don't trust stuff in alliance war i can evade it but in alliance war no telling look at that i got hit this is why i just block and i'm just sitting here when i got hit i'm like are you serious that's why i just block now look i evaded that one the reason i did that is because after i got hit i was like no we got to deal with this oh now here i'm worried i'm worried we just barely avoided a special three there just barely so there i swiped to get the uh falter off me that was close i was sweating bullets there okay we probably would have survived it you know i still had the uh invulnerability uh, on so it wasn't you know that bad but still it was still nerve-wracking okay uh because i believe i still had like uh two invulnerability charges at this point in time all right, so we're still going. I only have one charge left now. So I'm just like, you know what? Let's go ahead and uh, start hitting with the mediums. As you see, there's the two indestructibles. So now I don't have any more charges. All right, and I got so upset with this. After all of that work, okay, watch what I do now. Boom, messed up. I used up the charge just before I fired off the special two. After working all of that, 
so that I could do the special two, I couldn't stop my reflex. And I swiped, used up the charge so that my special two, which should have killed him, didn't do anywhere near the damage it should have. Just look at this. I'm just getting smacked up now. All right. Um, but we got him down. Ugly fight, you know, and I was doing so well. You know, I was doing the, you know, light attack, light attack, um, which didn't use my charge so I could build up, you know, got hit, which gave me even more power. So I was ready. All I had to do was fire off that special two. But instead, by reflex, I swiped and used the charge up. But no harm, no foul. We got it down. I've got charges for Corvus. Now we can move on to section two. Someone already took that uh, mini down. And we've got Colossus here. So you already know, if you've watched my war videos, who I'm going to be using against this Colossus. Got to do it. Claire, she is the GOAT, for me anyway, for fighting Colossus on this node especially. She's just perfect for it. Um, she's not the only one that can take uh, Colossus on this node, but she's perfect. She strips him of his armor. She can be bleed immune. She can be poison immune. She can be, um, you know, incinerate immune. But on this node, just the fact that she can be bleed immune is enough. But that bleed doesn't really do a lot of damage anyway. And it's only a chance to get the bleed on you when he has armor ups which she strips away. So yeah, she's just like, for me, the perfect counter for that node. All right, next up, and this is actually gonna be the last fight uh, for me of this war, because at this time, they've already cleared out mini boss island and the boss. So when I came in here, I was like, oh, righty, they're already pretty much done. Uh, so I'm just cleaning up. And uh, you can see there's no more of that, um, I think, what was it, high ground or whatever. There's no more of that because the boss is already down at this point. So I'm just going in. You know, I've got three uh, missions done, three Corvus charges. And you can just see I'm just ripping them apart. Not even worrying about no medium like medium, just going all out. Boom, boom. Finished him with a special. And he's cooked. And done. Okay? Um, so... That was it for my participation in this war. And this is actually the final war that you'll see for this season. Uh, because of some issues that they were having, uh, they ended the season early. So the next war, I didn't even bother recording because it didn't count anyway. And then there were no more wars after that. All right. So in a moment, we're going to come back and you're going to find out how this war ended. And we're back. And as you can see, we won this war. So the final war that counts of the season, we finished with a win. Now, where we place in this season, I don't know. We had some losses. We had some wins. Time will tell. Uh, probably uh, on Monday. So by the time you see this video, we will already have had our rewards and everything. All right, but that's going to do it for the video. Thank you all for watching. Feel free to hit that like button if you enjoyed it. Leave a comment. Let me know what you thought about this video. And you all have a blessed day.